Welcome back everyone. It is StarCraft 2. It is the arcade and it is my favorite game in the arcade. Direct Strike and its commanders. I'm playing as a bit of a random. I got tired of picking my own side so I'm letting the computer decide who I play. Oh, breathe. It's so stuffy in here. Holy crap. What is that? <laughs> oh, funny. Funny, 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 funny. By the way, anybody watching this, give me your opinion. I am looking to get my son a GPU. And I'm considering... He's got a 980 at the moment, by the way. I have a spare 5600 that I'm going to pop into with a different machine, but I'm wondering, should I get him the 4060, RTX 4060? What's your recommendation in and around the 300, 350 euro, 350 pound mark? Just wondering, what would be your suggestion? Obviously, I need something that is better than the 980. I think, hang on, let me rephrase that. Everything lately is better than a 980. Uh, he's looking to play different kinds of games. And just looking what's out there. He's currently running an AMD system. Which he might, or which we might upgrade to a... That's a 5800X in the future, we'll see. So got a bunch of plans, or well, 5600, depends on what we go for. Power supply is at 850 Corsair units, so that's not a problem. I think we can safely deal with that. Yellow is a Zerg. Probably going air. Uh, don't care. He's going air and I don't care. No, no, no. I don't care. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. I, I got carried away there a bit. Because why not? It's a lovely Wednesday for me. This will probably be a Thursday episode for you. It's the first episode where I'm not completely drugged out of my mind on legal doctor stuff that they gave me. I'm actually lucid. I'm, I'm here. I'm with you. I hope I'm using that correctly. Anyway. Whew. This room is just stuffy. That's the only concern that I have. My units aren't doing as well as I want them to do. What is he doing? That's my question. I want to see. <laughs> it is as if I read his mind. I knew it was a Kerrigan. It's just so obvious. If they wait when they're a Zerg, they can only be a Kerrigan. Because you don't wait as an Abathur. Unless you want to deploy like a whole bunch of... What's the things? Um, hosts. You also... That's the wrong one. You also don't wait if you're a Zagara. Because you want to get out a bunch of... You, well, you get out Zagara first. Because that's important. Zagara is quite OP. So you get her out, then you look to build on your explody things, i.e. banelings. And from there you move on to... Well, it depends on what your opponent goes. He's finally got her out. I didn't upgrade this one yet. This sucks. Because I've got to deal with this guy's crap the whole time. He just leaks. He's a leaky boy. I don't, uh, hmm. That Rainer just got absolutely annihilated. And I do mean that in every possible sense of the word. He got so ripped a new one, it is not even funny. <laughs> it's just... Sorry for the graphic imagery. Beat your wave 
It is so frustrating when he doesn't beat his wave. Now I've got to can deal with this. I did not want to go for an Aegis Guard, but I am going to have to go with the Aegis Guard because I can't do anything else. Hmm. What is he doing? He's not doing much, is, I think, the problem. And the same is now happening here. Oh, hell. My allies are letting me down. It's always the case. It's never my fault. It's always my allies. They're always the ones that's terrible. Yeah, he, he can't really make more because this guy does very well versus light. So Hellbats are not the option to go for. I would say he's actually doing quite well for where he's supposed to be or supposed to be fighting against. But this is good. Finally, I can get hold of this woman and blow the living bejesus out of her. I very rarely play with uh, the Emperor's Shadow. I don't know why, I just never like them. But they are doing a job for us here, ladies and gentle folks. They are doing a job for us here. I like it. I like it so much I'm going to go for an extra refinery thing. Is it refinery this time? Yes, it is. Extractors are... Zerg? Assimil yes, assimilators are Protoss. I remember the thing! <laughs> it's sad when I get this excited for remembering something. I think. Uh, oh, oh bless him. <laughs> he's gone detection. And he's gone detection for them. That's, that is funny. For those of you who don't know, when they go cloak... They're completely undetectable, even by detection. <laughs> well done. Well done, lads. You've done it. I didn't buy a thing. Crap. That's the other problem. I forget to buy things like that. That is supposedly standard issue. Because I don't play Manx Skull that much. I didn't... For quite a while now, I've been... Putting off, essentially using random but I feel now more than ever seeing as my channel is getting not successful but moderately getting a few people to watch it it's it's important for me to play it how, how do I say this to play it a bit more authentic I can say yeah I'm gonna go for this but it's so unpredictable what the enemy does that it is almost impossible to say beforehand yeah i'm definitely going to play phoenix i'm definitely going to go for swarm host i can persevere with it but i'm probably sure we're gonna lose if i would say i'm gonna go into this and i'm just gonna build what's these things um warhounds i'm thinking about buying warhounds but it's not necessarily the best idea for where we are in the match. What I'm looking to now is what am I going to go for next? This guy seems to be a very big noob. I am going T3 because if he does go for Muta, which I think he will go eventually, he's gone T3, so he might be going for... <laughs> I think what he's going to go for is the... Uh, Oh gosh, what's the thing's name? Broodlord! He's gonna go for the Broodlord. And if he does go for Broodlord, then I'm going to counter him with Sky Fury. And if he then decides to go for the other thing, the uh, Mutalisks. I've got Mutalisks on my own, but I'm not gonna use them. I'm going to use a Black Hammer. Why Black Hammer? Because they 
absolutely eat mutilisks alive. Oh, I remember that bloke yesterday. It was so funny. Oh, I'm, I can't win with Abathur versus Mengsk, and I did that earlier today. I, I owned the Mengsk. Did somebody... Oh, you, you, <laughs> um, okay, I'm speechless, officially, at the tactic that this guy just tried to pull. He went and built Ultralix, which is heavy armor, versus this guy that has this ability. That is stupid. Don't do that. Don't do that at all. That is just the... I don't... I can't fathom how somebody would think that is a good idea. At all. That, that just doesn't make sense. I'm just gonna go pride. We're gonna make like we're woke and go pride. It's pride month. Or Pride of August grad in this case, but it's pride nonetheless. We're proud to display our power, and you're gonna see now what I mean by this. Look at that. It's just bang, 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 and it it dies a horrible, nasty, crunching death. And I'm not even I'm honestly not even trying at this point. It is just a matter of Okay. And I just bought another upgrade for something I don't really need. I could perhaps go for intercessors, get some healing. I don't go for that me nearly often enough. Let's see. I think we're going to go for the weird strategies that I don't normally go for and see how that works out. Just because we're doing well. I'm... I can't see that they're getting back in this anytime soon. Uh, I'm growing this. So I, when I do get this, I can just level up to T3. And the Imperial Intercessor is going to make my units last that little bit longer. Because... And there we get that. I'm happy. You're happy. Everybody is happy. We're winning. I mean... We're winning that... That is just so redundant at this point. But you can't fathom how silly some of these plays seem to me. It really is just... How did they think going for Ultralisks? Let's see. I'm, I want to go see what this guy's doing. He's got all four, which is good. That's generally good. I mean, I've got all four already. He's got all four. This guy is lagging way behind. But he's been struggling... A bit from the beginning. Though I have to say he's caught up a hell of a lot since then. But just... I, I don't know. This guy's not building much. If you're this far behind going for four gas, it's obviously not, not recommended. I wanted to see if... Damn it. Okay. Whatever. Whatever. Is this gonna expire? Yay, we got expired units. I'm gonna check. We've got one expired unit, and that was that one. We saw what happened. <laughs> this is about to end, I think. I don't think we're going to get out of pride. I like the design of these tanks. They're, they're quite nice. I don't know which ones those are, but they're quite nice. I like them. Also, you... Okay, well, he's not technically supposed to be going up against uh, the Taikas. So I guess it's not a criticism of him. It's like, you can't play Muta versus Tychus. Oh, the Broodlord's in play. I told you he's going to go Broodlord. It's useless. <laughs> the, the Broodlords have been Broodlords. Oh, my Lord. I can't even say it. The Broodlords have been nerfed so badly that it's not even funny anymore. They are absolutely useless. Uh... They used to be quite good, and they sometimes are still quite good if you're playing against an absolutely idiot, Meng um, not Mengsk, uh, idiot um, 
what's the guy's name? Tychus. You you can beat them with it. But other than that, there's not much point in going for a brood lord. Not at this stage of the game anyway. There's just nothing that the brood lords can bring to the table that's going to help you in any way with a win. My sad attempt at making a G. I should have moved that one a bit that way. That one should have been a bit up. It's G, people. It's G. G, G. <laughs> oh, I, I should probably have not built this because I feel it's almost bad mannered to build it at this stage. It's like, uh, look at me. <laughs> I've got this thing. <laughs> I'm going to kill you all. And that is basically what's happening here. They've got no answer to it. It just... It literally just moved there because it can. Oh, you bastard. You They just pulled me into the range of that. That is so sad. I was hoping that's going to go the distance. I'll buy more of these. I, what else do you want me to buy? Maybe tanks? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, they've got a lot of these guys now. Uh, what do I do? They've got many of them. Many. Look. Look. Oh. They dead. <laughs> I've got two of these. <laughs> Oops. You dead. <laughs> Uh, go there. Boink. <laughs> I'm just screwing around. I, even if it dies, what, what's that to me? <coughs> Oopsie. <laughs> it died again. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is. I'm. I'm so bad mannered in this. I'm. I'm no. I'm not. I'm. I'm not telling them. Oh, you suck. I'd never do that. I used to be like that. I used to be a. Oh, I used to be a cock end. Proper one. Proper knob. Now I am much better. What's this? Uh, oh, that's the networking outlaws. Oh, it even cools down those guys. I mean, maybe the G was a bit much, but come on, let's look past that. I don't have anything else to do. I'm literally waiting for them to die. That's a bit morbid. Uh, oh, they've got anti-air. <laughs> Finally. Took them long enough. Still not doing much. I wonder, if should I go for a second pride? Can I? I, I had to check if I can get two prides. Apparently you can. Pride of August. Grat. No, no. Oh, you. oh, we moved not far enough. Crap. Crap on a cracker. I was hoping we'd move far enough. Oh, uh, no. Stay there. For the next one, we'll move to the side. If we're going to make it, are we going to win it right here? Is this the end? Tune in for another episode of They Don't Want to Concede. I wish you could concede in this, because sometimes I'd like to concede, especially when I'm paired up with any DS clan. DSC Pro, DS whatever. You guys are horrible people. And that was proven again today in... Two or three different matches where I just... Whew, they get my blood boiling, man. I'm telling you, you get my blood boiling. I don't like them. They are absolutely horrific people. And it's not... They've got, number one, no skill. Number two, they are always toxic. Always levers. Always just nasty to everybody. Nobody can play as well as I can because I'm in a DSC clan. Really? I've seen potatoes play better than you, but, you know, if you want to stroke your ego, stroke away. It's the only, only stroke you're going to get. DSC just really gets me raging. I'd never rage quit, but I would sell all my units. I would be that kind of toxic if I get paired up with a DSC. I, I can't stand them. Really, really, really. Of all the things in the world, that's the one thing I cannot stand. 
Rage of the day. Maybe I should make that a thing. This is the rage of the day. Brought to you by DSC Hatred. No, DSC really... Ugh. Okay, anyway, enough of DSC. Let's see what's happening here. There's not much happening, to be very honest. The, holy God. That was just a whole bunch of people that died there. It's like... Everything dead, boy. Everything dead. You look at him, he's dead. <laughs> I'm gonna go for another one of these. Not only that's gonna put some ultralist down. I don't know what to build. To be very frank with you, I have no idea what else to go for. They're doing a very good job of pushing us, not back, but just keeping us occupied enough to, you know, <laughs> to not win, which is kind of sucky. Uh, can't build one yet. Let's see, where do I stand in the rankings? 35%, 700, everything is looking, everything is looking good. We just can't seem to put the nail in the coffin. But I do think it might happen here. That that was a big... How did it not get many kills? Okay, that's GG. Come on, I want... Quickly, quickly, quickly! Oh yeah, that was... I, I had to get that one out. Whoo! <laughs> oh yeah. That is excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. We did well. I like that match a lot. I don't know, I just had this good feeling. And everything just went well. Actually, oh, 10 points. 10 points, 10 kills away from being the best. Units. Uh, okay, here I didn't do that well. It, they weren't as valuable, the units I killed. But this was good. So everything went relatively good for us. But this... I don't know, this whole setup was very poor versus a Mengsk. I would have, personally, if somebody opened uh, the Flamers against me, I would have gone for something completely different. It just doesn't make sense going for that. I, I don't know, what would I have gone Probably have gone for the Lurkers. Lurkers might have been a better option. Because that definitely wasn't... <laughs>